so welcome to the new video uh, this is about the different features of amphioxus why amphioxus is put it in a separate sub file and so what are its primitive features what are its degenerative features and what are the specialized features primitive features means what that which is ancient no so one of the character is what the presence of notochord is a primitive features Mostly in the advanced animals, the notochord is replaced by vertebral column. And the second one is what myotonic segmentation. You can see clearly the muscles are segmented, which is seen externally. It is visible. Huh? There is a second one and simple circulatory system without heart. There is no specialized heart is there. Even though it is comes under the chordata, there is no definite heart and a simple circulatory system. And a straight elementary canal starting from the mouth and ends in the anus. There is no complications. A simple elementary canal. Segmented nephridia. Uh, in each segment, there will be nephridia, which is a character of what? Analyta. So, same as here. Then, segmented gonads. You can see the gonads here. So, mostly in the higher vertebrates, only two gonads are present. A pair of gonads are present either ovary or testis. But it is each segment. Most of the segments possess the gonads. Lack of jaws, there is no jaw. This is, it shows the primitive characters. In ciliary feeding, even though it is a chordata, it feeds by ciliary mode of action. Ciliary feeding and endostyle. Endostyle represents what is the thyroid gland. In modern animals, endostyle means the thyroid gland. So the presence of endostyle means what? It's a primitive animals. So these are the, so how many characters? Eight. Eight characters that belongs to the primitive features then move moves on to the specialized features what are the special features that are assigned to the uh, amphioxus so there is a delicate pharynx not not much strong pharynx prolonged not notochord for burrowing so notochord which is the blue color the above one blue color which is prolonged up to the up to the head region which helps to burrow in the soil Normally, amphioxus is seen in world in the sand, sandy beaches. So, in order to burrow, so this notochord helps. Then, vellum and oral hood for filter feeding. So, vellum, you can see the vellum here, and oral hood, it help, which helps in filter feeding. The large pharynx, this is a large pharynx with numerous gills. You can see the gills is like here to maintain the flow of, flow of water. A large atrium. It is surrounded by the uh, pharynx is surrounded by atrium to protect it. So these are some of the specialized features of what amphi amphioxus, and there are some certain degenerative features are also there. Amphioxus also has certain degenerative features. So what are they? So they have uh, absence of well developed brain and sense organ. There is no specialized brain and sense organs, absence of well developed endoskeleton. The endoskeleton is not a code, is not much strong, is not much well developed. Forward extension of notochord preventing the development of a brain. So, this extension of the notochord. cavity. Brain develop but here the ex, uh, notochord is extent up to the head region, so the, it affects the development of the brain. Then absence of gonodects, there is no gonodects. That means no vas differentia, no vas differentia, etc. There is no such uh, ducts are there. So these are all degenerative features. So it has specialized features. It has primitive features and it has degenerative features. And what are the affinities with chordates? So there are certain characters which are assigned to non-chordates. So what are they? So most of the non-chordates do doesn't have any brain and sense organs. They ha they have no endoskeleton. Instead of that, there is this exoskeleton. The extension of notochord preventing the development of the brain. The brain is not developed fully because of the presence of notochord and the absence of gonodics. So these, so most of the uh, non-chordates 
possess all these characters absence of gonadoids absence of well developed brain there is no well developed endoskeletons all these characters so that's why there is an affinity to us non codates so what are the char uh, characters that is similar to the Euro urocodates so it shows ciliary feeding ciliated pharynx with the numerous gill slits endostyle which resembles thyroid gland atrium around pharynx simple respiratory mechanism with no organs for respirations early embryonic development is similar to both groups that means the uh, in the urocodate and the cephalocodate both the development the embryonic development is more or less similar so what are the characters that is similar to vertebrates so there is a presence of post tail myotonic segmentations muscles are segmented blood flow forward ventrally and backward dorsally so the blood flow is flowing through the ventral portion so first one is the heart load of one heart load of heart to pump in a summit the heart and the portion is on the ventral portion of the load of pump is it when an earth is on the you the power goes to the air carrier inferior vena cover is superior vena cover in a retreat to heart like it so this is similar to what vertebrates and hepatic cecum comparable to vertebrate liver so there is a hepatic cecum in the uh, cephalocodates that is similar to the vertebrate liver endostyle is homologous to thyroid gland thyroid gland is present in the vertebrates while endostyle is present in the cephalocodate hmm? so the primitive form of thyroid gland is what the endostyle so these are the characters which resembles the vertebrates now what is the systematic position of the amphioxus where do you place the amphioxus in the classification Amphioxus in every day place here and put since it possesses all the three fundamental characters of chordate Chordate in all the characters of the chronic indolence all the three fundamental characters. It's a chordate. What are the fundamental characters? Presence of notochord, presence of postural tail and pharynx with the gills rays. So this hence it is a chordate Since it has a mixture of primitive degenerate and specialized characters cannot be chordate but a primitive chordate other primitive characters and degenerative characters and specialized characters of Kikanik in order to coordinate the matrol per thumb and debut clear karna which shows the primitive characters primitive coded characters so close to ancestor vertebrates so these characters are close to what ancestor vertebrates so vertebrates in the ancestry and the poor vigor and other characters on e characters not the upper edin is that a do it resemblance here vertebrate at a resemblance here the vertebrate are different and but differs with vertebrate hence placed in a cephalocodate of a chordate on a visual chordate on a but she the primitive got it chordate in the characters on a kind of a primitive chordate in the characters normally on a vertebrate in the ancestral characters not only on so vertebrate on a ala of a vertebrate to Allah chordate chordate to Allah for no matter chordate to Allah for no matter vertebrate to Allah other one day isn't it you know the scientists put it in a separate class called separate subfile called cephala coda is it clear so that so that's it so this is a systematic systematic position of what arm um,